news. We are here at uh, Red Bank, New Jersey at the Molly Pitcher Inn for a wedding today. We're celebrating Bryant and Amanda's wedding. And it's uh, gonna be a lot of fun. A little windy out, but uh, we have beautiful views of the water. Check this out. Yeah, look at that, look at that, look at that, look at that, look at that. Puerto Rican and Dominican wedding today, so it should be a lot of fun. We do not have much gear or equipment. We only have uh, sound, sound equipment, and we're also gonna do dancing on the clouds, which means we basically only have sound equipment. So it's gonna be a uh, relatively easy wedding for me and Christian. The usual four hour reception, one hour cocktail, one hour ceremony. Ceremony usually only lasts 30 minutes, but we start playing 30 minutes beforehand while guests are arriving. Aside from that, we just arrived, so we are going to run inside and uh, start checking, checking, checking it out. All right, here we go. Let's We went inside and uh, there's another party happening right now. So, uh, we are pretty much beat until four o'clock, which means we'll have about an hour and a half to set everything up. Like I said, not a lot of equipment, so it's not a big deal, but if there was a lot of equipment, it would have been a very big deal. We usually arrive about three hours beforehand, so we have about, I don't know, an hour and a half to kill, which uh, is a bad thing. You mustn't kill time, boys. You must cherish. <laughs> oh, this is when Superman gets changed. You should go get changed. <laughs> That's, that is where I should go get changed. So this is it right here. This is everything. We have my SRX speakers today. Two sets of tripods, both of them Frankenstands, F1s and F2. Speaker for cocktail hour, which will actually be happening in this room right here. This is the cocktail room. Microphone, mixer for ceremony. We have my toolbox with uh, miscellaneous tools. Dry ice for the dry ice machine, which is uh, right underneath here. And we also have a uh, cable bag. Party cleared out. We are uh, officially moving our stuff into place. Uh, it's actually a pretty small room, pretty small room. This is our dance floor right here. The setup right here in the middle. So right in the center of the dance floor, which will be right here along this pillar here. Checking in, I'm officially suited up, ready to rock and roll. We are at our ceremony right now. Uh, it's very, 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 very windy ceremony. I feel bad because their flowers just tumbled over. But uh, aside from that, everything is uh, going smoothly on our end, on the DJ side of things. We have our cocktail set up and we also have our reception partially set up. While people enjoy their cocktail, we are gonna finish up our reception. And uh, that should pretty much do it as far as things on that. And ceremony should be pretty straightforward. We're using one of the speakers here for ceremony and then we'll repurpose that for reception. So after that, that's pretty much it. It is with great honor I present to you Mr. and Mrs. Rosario. So check this out, we're officially going to open up the dance floor. If you love Brian, if you love Amanda, I need somebody to make some noise out there. Let's party. Oh, my God. 
Friends and family, it's officially time for the sweetest part of the evening. Our newlyweds are getting ready to cut their wedding cake. So get your cameras ready. It's officially time for cake. And don't forget, if you're on social media, use our hashtag Ring Around the Rosarios. Ring Around the Rosarios. You give me all of you. Beautiful song from our newlyweds to all you guys. Thank you. Here we go. I want, I want to feel the love in this room. Everybody bring it in. Thank you so much. On behalf of Amanda and Brian, my name is DJ Corey. Good night. Good night, everybody. Thank you. We are here with Brian and Amanda. These two just got married. Yeah. Brand new Mr. Yeah. Brand new Mr. Oh, she was backing it up, actually. <laughs> Brand new Mr. and Mrs. Rosario. How was it guys? Did you guys have fun or what? Last, um, the party just didn't stop jumping on the It was truly amazing. Uh, you know, you got everybody on the dance floor. Everybody was excited. Um, they couldn't stop dancing for some reason. I don't know if it was the music, if it was you emceeing. I don't know what it was, but they couldn't stop. <laughs> it was the Hennessy at the bar. <laughs> um, but listen, it was a, an amazing experience. Um, thank you guys. And uh, I look forward to inviting you guys to another party. Uh, yes. yes! First one named DJ Bar. <laughs> <laughs> and just like that, another one is officially in the books. This one was a damn good one. It was a lot of fun. I had a lot of fun DJing for this crowd. And I can always tell from the start of a party whether or not it's going to be a good night. And there's some things that I look for. First up, when I do my introductions, when I introduce the bride and groom, if the people go nuts, for the bride and groom, I know it's gonna be a good night. When they start going nuts, you hear whistling, screaming, clapping, you know these people are ready to party. But at this particular party, there was one thing, and that's just one thing that gave away that it was gonna be an awesome night. We pull up to the bar, and there was a huge sign that said, please try our couple's signature drink. And you know what the signature drink was? Coke and Hennessy. So I knew it was gonna be a crazy night. As soon as I saw that sign, I'm like, damn, these people are drinking Hennessy tonight? It's gonna be a crazy night. And it damn sure was. It was a hell of a party. This was an awesome crowd, awesome couple. Everything was smooth all around us. I got to pretty much have free reign. Took me back to my nightclub days. I was throwing in reggaeton, merengue, salsa, uh, you know, hip hop, even threw in a uh, line dance. Uh, at the end, we actually closed up with the Cupid Shuffle. I've never closed a party with the Cupid Shuffle, so that was a first. I do wanna thank the sponsor of today's video, HoneyBooks. HoneyBooks is an awesome, an easy way to manage your business. It's great for small businesses just like DJs. You can send contracts, send brochures, automate emails, get paid, get that money, that cheddar, that guap in your bank account. HoneyBooks makes all this easy. It's a CRM system and it's great for any working mobile DJ. Great way to stay up to date with your bookings and your finances. I'm gonna leave a link down below where you can get 50% off your first year. It's gonna be left down in the description of this video as well as the first comment. I'll also be leaving all the links to my equipment down below. So be sure to check those out. If you have any questions about this particular video, leave them down in the comments below. I'll be sure to get back to you guys. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to like like it, subscribe if you're new around here, and if you really want to help me out, don't forget to turn on that bell so you can be notified next time we do another video. You might have another video coming uh, Friday this week, and then next week I'll be at DJ Expo. If you'll be there, let me know down in the comments below. I'd love to hear from you. Signing off, your boy, your homie, DJ Bar. Stay awesome, bros. Peace.